It's not Christmas Day, it's not Easter Day, it's not Memorial Day, it's not Flag Day, it's not even Groundhog's Day. It's Father's Day. What up, Dr. Daniel? Will Kirby, big brother, legend. Checking in with a crazy story. So I'm walking down the street, right? Minding my own business. I got a big, big uh, mask on to protect myself. I got my dark glasses on. I got a big hat, three-inch brim to protect my... Gorgeous skin, AirPods, long sleeves. My collar is popped. There's no way anyone could recognize me. It would be an impossibility to recognize me. And yet, two people run up to me. They just run up right in my personal space. And I'm like, whoa! Social distancing, please. Please, young gentlemen. Social distancing, please. And they're like, O-M-G. G. Two Gs. Dr. Daniel, two G's. Goodness gracious, goodness gracious. They can't believe it. They say, Dr. Will, and I say, how did you recognize me? How did you know who I was? Like, how did you know that it was me? And they were like, oh, Dr. Will, your aura is just pumping off your body like a vibration off your soul on the beach of Ibiza at sunrise from a bass speaker at a rave. And I was like, that actually makes complete sense. How can I help you, gentlemen? And they're like, listen, our dad is a huge Dr. Will fan and a huge Big Brother fan. And would you please reach out to him and wish him a happy Father's Day? And I said, no. Maybe. Maybe I'll wish him a happy Father's Day. But see, I'm not into physical possessions. I'm not into material possessions. I'm not into even video chats. I'm into philosophical exploration. So I want to test the content of his character. So what I would like to do is lay out a theoretical situation. It's just a quiz. As a healthcare practitioner, he has participated in many, many, many tests and examinations and quizzes. Well, this one only has one question. It's A or B. Okay, it's simply A or B. So what I am going to do, what I would like to do is I'm going to float out a theoretical situation. Then I'm going to pose this question to Daniel, and then he's going to answer it. And then Matt and Jeff, you, me, and your dad will all know what kind of person he is, okay? We're going to know a whole lot more about the content of his character. And more importantly, he'll know a whole lot more about himself. So in this, so let's do that. Theoretical situation, then Dr. Daniel, you just answer the question, okay? Then we'll know all, we'll all know about you, and we'll know what kind of father you really are, okay? So in this scenario, the four of us, Matt, Jeff, Daniel, we're watching a little show called Big Brother. It's near and dear to my heart. This is like a month from now. Three of us are watching it. I got my feet up on the coffee table. One arm around Daniel, one arm around Matt. Jeff's getting us some nachos and the show starts, right? Julie Chen comes on and she says, this is going to be the most twisted season of Big Brother in its 22 seasons. In its 20 years, this is going to be our most deranged season season because we're going to tell you the twist during this first HOH. She snaps her fingers and they start the HOH, right? And the house guests, they can't hear her, but unbeknowingly to her, she can, she talks to us unbeknowingly to them. She's talking to us and she says, here's our 16 new house guests. Don't they look handsome and beautiful in their bathing attire? And they're all, you know, just innocent walking around the pool right now. Well, what they don't know is that we have, Filled the air conditioners here at the Big Brother house with COVID virus, with coronavirus 19, the COVID pandemic. So these house guests unknowingly are going to be exposed to a viral pathogen. Now, really quickly, side note, I don't endorse this. I don't welcome this. I don't encourage this. I'm just saying this is the dark scenario that Julie Chen has po proposed for us, okay? So we're watching and we can't believe it. Daniel, you can't believe it. I can't believe it. Matt, Jeff, we're all in disbelief. But now, but it has occurred. And now the question is, what are you going to do? Daniel, do you take the remote control, turn the television show off and say, listen, I am going to be a great example to my sons and to Dr. Will, and I am not going to participate as a viewer in the show and I'm going to turn it off. That's choice A. It's the righteous thing, the correct thing, the moral thing, the ethical thing. Or B, do you say, you know what? It's already on TV. Here's my remote control. I think I'm going to DVR it. We're going to continue to watch this show. Maybe we'll go to the online chats and gossip about the house guests. And 
We also could subscribe to the 24 hour live feeds just to see what happens. That's B, that's the immoral thing, that's the incorrect thing to do, that's the, um, that's the unethical thing, right? So A or B, Daniel. Now, before you answer, because I know this is a pressure-filled question, before you have to make this incredible life decision in front of your own family, I want you to take a minute, maybe you need a potty break, maybe you need to tinkle, maybe you need to meditate on this, discuss it with your family members. While you're doing that, I am not a hypocrite. I'm gonna vote as well. I'm raising my hand very high and I am voting. And of my choice between those two options, my choice is B. My choice is B and your choice is also B. You know you're gonna watch it, Dr. Daniel. You know you're gonna watch it and Matt and Jeff are gonna watch it too. And that means that you are really a Dr. Wheel fan and are truly a Big Brother fan because you're gonna watch it no matter what. And it, yeah, it's a little bit deranged of you to make that choice, but I like that a lot. So Dr. Daniel, I wanna wish you on a very serious note, and I hope that doesn't happen, but if it does, let's watch it, okay? I'll watch it with you guys. We can connect on social media and chat about it on Twitter and on Instagram. But Dr. Daniel, on a very serious note, I wanna wish you the happiest Father's Day ever, and it sounds to me like you've already won it, because it sounds to me like you have two great sons who know you very, very well. And Matt, Jeff, and Daniel, for all of us, myself included, I wish that we have a, I hope that we have a great summer filled with unadulterated, unstructured, and unscripted reality television in the form of Big Brother. So happy Father's Day, Daniel, from Dr. Will Kirby, Big Brother Royalty.